As the 2014 softball season comes to an end, the Titans take on the Broncos of Santa Clara for their last non-conference game. Top of the first was a quick 1-2-3 for pitcher Christina Washington. Tuchiyama comes up to bat and doubles to the left side of the field. Two bats later, Aragon singles, bringing Tuchiyama in for the first score of the game. Galarza comes in hot with a double, finishing off the bottom of the first with a 2 to nothing lead. In the top of the second, number 23 singles up the middle, trying to wake the team up, but the Broncos just couldn't get going. They remained scoreless in this inning. In a bottom of the second with a score of 4 to nothing, Galarza goes up to bat with two runners on base and two outs. Hits a homer and brings the score 6 to nothing. Takes a little work, but the Broncos get their first score of the game with a single by number 17 in the top of the third. In the bottom of the fourth, the bases are loaded. Takiyo hits a foul ball, but the ump calls it an illegal pitch and sends Kiesling home. Three more runs in this inning brings the score 12 to one. The game is called in the top of the fifth as the Titans get their ninth run roll game of the season. Samantha Galarza talks to us about that home run and coach gives us the scoop on their preparations for their next game. Pretty much every at bat I just tell myself to believe that all things are possible and just continue just having a positive mindset and that's definitely helpful. You know, tomorrow morning what we're going to do is we're really going to watch a lot of footage. We're going to um, look at some numbers and talk about our game plan with the team and, and get us all on the same page. And, you know, I know um, UC Davis is a tough conference opponent and it's do or die right now. So we're going to just, you know, I guess enjoy the pressure. With only six games left in the season and all of them being conference play, the Titans are looking to advance from fourth place in the conference. The ladies will go on to take UC Davis Aggies on Saturday, May 3rd at 4 p.m. And then you can catch that on ESPN3 and watch ESPN. From Anderson Family Field, Kaylee Krish, Titan Sports Recap.